The pivotal role of legislative diplomacy in bridging the gap between the executive and legislative arms of government has again been reiterated by the office of the Senate President. Speaking on ADBN TV flagship program, Morning Express, the special advisor on media and publicity to the President of the Senate, SMA Ayibo, praised Senator Godswell Akpabio for his exemplary servant leadership and urged the Senate to transcend ethnic, religious and political divides in the interest of national unity. If you know Senator Goswila Pabio, C-O-N, uh, you would definitely appreciate the fact that his human nature is made up of a generous heart. And when a generous act, I mean a generous heart, exhibits an act, such act is going to also be very beneficial to humanity. And uh, you recall that for 59 years, we were absent in the inter Nigeria as a country, you know, we were absent in the International Parliamentary Union for 59 years. And when he emerged as a Senate president and went there, and of course, uh, he was elected into the executive committee. And that was when Nigeria, as a matter of fact, now started going into, you know, the throne room of uh, legislative diplomacy. I've not seen any senator who is admitted on oath representing a particular religion or representing uh, a particular religion or representing tribe, a tribe or ethnicity or something like that but within the province of within, within the province of the law the principle as the senate president encapsulated is this, is that principle which is re reflected and domesticated in the constitution by saying we the people of nigeria the SA Media also stressed the need for public awareness regarding the legislative functions carried out by the National Assembly. A lot of people believe that National Assembly is just Senate and House of Reps, which is not correct. It's not correct. There is National Institute of Legislative Studies graduating every year, postgraduate people, uh, postgraduate students and all of that, adding value, you know, to our uh, skill development. There is National Assembly Service Commission having his own bureaucracy with a lot of our people also working there. You also have the budget office. You know? Now, the same National Assembly has the clerk. There's bureaucracy of the National Assembly had, headed by the clerk of the National Assembly. So is the, the Senate and House of Reps is the, the political leadership of the National Assembly, Assembly is headed by the chairman who is the president of the Senate. So when you hear budget, National Assembly budget are eating this money, they're eating that money, it's not correct because people have not taken the trouble of understanding what constitutes the National Assembly.